Michigan football fans, big time road win on Saturday at number nine, Penn State. Back to back wins against number 11, Minnesota at home, number nine, Penn State. Michigan is up to number three in the country at six and zero on the season. Got Indiana coming up today in the seventh game of the year. Before we jump into the game, I'm going to walk you guys through the top 25 and the Heisman Trophy race. A lot of you guys have been asking about that. So take a look at those and we'll pop right into the game. Go blue. All right, so top 25 polls, you guys. Let's take a look. All right, so you see Clemson is getting most of the votes there. 34, uh, Notre Dame is undefeated 5-0, 25. Michigan, Mississippi State, surprising. UCF, Northwestern, beat Ohio State, beat Wisconsin. They've got a big one against Minnesota. They're number six. Michigan's going to end the year this year with Northwestern. According to our schedule that we couldn't change, Northwestern, Iowa, Ohio State, all ranked inside the top 15 right now. Texas, Miami, Ohio State sitting there at 5-1. and one. They lost to Northwestern a couple weeks ago. Then you got a surprising Memphis. Baylor, kind of skip down here, 11 through 20. Baylor, Utah, Oklahoma. Penn State, after that one-point loss to, uh, to yours truly. Iowa, South Carolina, Minnesota, Alabama, Florida, UAB, are they even a program still? I don't know. Uh, Tennessee, Kansas State, Auburn, Georgia, surprising three and three. They got blown out by Clemson earlier in the year. And then Texas A&M. That doesn't make much sense to me. Three and three, Georgia, 24, five and one, Texas A&M, number 25. I don't know, but that is your top 25, folks. Take a look at the Heisman. Well, look at the top of the Big Ten really quick. Show you guys the Big Ten conference standings really quick. All right, so here is the Big Ten leaders division. I guess they're still calling that in 2013. Um, Michigan 6-0, 4-2 Penn State. Indiana, who are playing today, 3-2. Uh, Michigan State, 2-3. Sorry about your luck, bro. Uh, L2 to get the legends. Northwestern, Iowa, Purdue, Nebraska, Wisconsin, Minnesota, Illinois in the awful Big Ten West, AKA legends. And then take a quick glance at the Heisman watch. But this is still the days of the BCS. So we will not uh, have a playoff in this season. Uh, Puka Williams uh, from Kansas, your, your Heisman Trophy front runner, I guess. Travis Etienne, Peyton Ramsey transferring uh, from Indiana to Northwestern is number three. Uh, Boyd from Arkansas. I don't even know who these last two guys are. Arkansas and Tulane. Um, that's that's the uh, the Heisman Trophy race as of now. So, showed you the top 25. Showed you the Heisman Trophy race. Showed you the Big Ten standings. Now we're going to jump into it. Michigan, Indiana, coming up right now. Let's go blue. All right, got Chris Evans back there. Let's see what he's got, baby. Whoop, whoop, whoop. All right, good run, good start. Um, Shot down the stats for you guys to talk about those. If anybody's interested, I know people seem to be, so I'll talk about those in a second. Wait a second, who is that behind quarterback, behind center? You guys see it. I know we're 6-0, I know we're number, number three in the country, but we have a quarterback controversy. Dylan McCaffrey gets the start today after Joe Milton's continued interception. So we're gonna see what happens with, okay, come on, Dylan. Starts off fresh, I like that. Three yards, a cloud of dust. Um, you guys might say, hey, it's on the coaching that Joe Milton's uh, throwing interceptions left and right, but I'm gonna go ahead and disagree with you, I think. Uh, team just needs something fresh on offense and Joe's gonna get some snaps today you can count on that <laughs> so you can get things start hot oh man under through him all right third and seven now McCaffrey has not done good at all when he's in this year uh, on coach Jimmy's team but um, Got to give him a shot because this offense has not been tearing it up by any means, right? <laughs> All right, we're going to go audible. Let's get the snap in. There you go. Nick Eubanks making, a, making a, an appearance in this offense. That's what I'm talking about. Let's say a replay. Just streaks up the middle. Wait, wait, wait. Quarterback hits him. 
I thought I was gonna break this tackle here, but nevertheless. Now we're humming, baby. Now we are humming. Bad read by McCaffrey, bad read there. That's okay. Right. <clears throat> so some of you guys are gonna say, wait, we, we, Michigan's not playing at Penn State this year. They don't have Indiana at home. I told some of the folks aren't able to, oh, bad, bad read. That's all right. Um, we are not playing the 2020 actual schedule because EA Sports does not let you edit uh, your schedule completely custom. All right, big third down here. Big third down. Indiana's defense is 71st in the country. You have 23.6 points per game, just for those who wondered. Oh, damn it. Ah, damn it, I threw it way too early, way too early. All right, we're gonna go for field goal, that's okay. Coward move, but points are points in this game. 41 yards, damn. I'm dealing with the delay too that we all know about. Okay. Whoop, get it, got it. Yep. All right, Purdue Michigan State 24 21. The Boilermakers beat the Spartans. Uh, Indiana on offense 32 points a game. They're top 20 and the number 19 in the country. Uh, 403 yards at 29th. They're pretty balanced. 220, uh, about 220 passing, 185 rushing. Ugh. Let's go. Nice job. Nice hit, Brad Hawkins. We're a blitzing team. I'm gonna make Selden my my boy here on the side. Oh yeah. Nice tackle. Who is that? Cam McGrone. Stevie Scott the third. They should have named you something different. Give me another rebound from damn it. <sighs> fooled the cameraman, fooled me. Yep, get pressure on him. All right, so this Michigan defense is third in the country, 8.8 .8 points a game, first in yards, 182.5, 21st in passing, First and rushing. Sounds like a, a DC Don kind of defense to me. It's only gonna matter if they do it against Ohio State though. Boom! Boom! Who was that? Quitty. Right, something different, little zone here. What kind of tackling is that? Wap Filer, Bill Yor, it's not a real name. Oh. 
trying to go for the ball. Nice. Quitty. I see it's turning all American in my eyes. So as you guys saw, I gave uh, McCaffrey the start today uh, in this game after Milton started the first six. So who's going to start? Is it Milton? Is it McCaffrey? Answer below. Uh, answer in the, in the live chat. And answer in the comments if you're watching this afterwards. Also, give me a like in the video. Like the video. Hit like. 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 Hit like. Give me a like. I'm going to ask again. Like. All right, three, three. You know, my predecessor, Coach Jim Harbaugh, in his first, in his five seasons at Michigan, I think he went to go overtime twice against Indiana. So come on, cut me some slack here. One drive, new quarterback. We're in a whoop, whoop, whoop. A lot better in kick returns right now than we were at the beginning of the season. And break out my playbook. Mike Sainer still, 11 yards. Talk about. <laughs> Pretty good start from McCaff. He almost had that one interception, but we figured it out. See these boys got downfield. Oh! <sighs> still dealing with that delay in the controllers. We haven't figured it out. I've got a team of hundreds of Google engineers on it. Nobody has figured it out yet for me, though. Yes, Ronnie Bell. Whoop, whoop. I just can't read on these read options sometimes. I, so I got coming in, I, I froze. Uh, McCaffrey averaging negative seven yards per carry. I think that's just include that sack, right? Or no? Oh gosh, what a dumb pass. These young men look tired. Whoop, Giles, touchdown. Cue up the victors, cue up the victors. that play. That's why I thought we had to make a change of quarterback. A little more efficient. 
Maybe not as explosive, but that was a little more efficient. Although, who are we kidding here? Should have at least two interceptions thrown by now, but I guess Dillon just got lucky where Milton has had more opportunities to get unlucky. Oh, G Moan. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. <laughs> I fell. Ugh. All right, let's see. <clears throat> Got our balanced offense. I'll give him that. So Nick, or nickel. Got to keep the pressure on these guys, though. That's all I'm saying. Darn, Kidding Hutch. Come on, man. That guy stiff arm the hell out of Aiden Hutchinson. Stevie Scott the third. Talking about who is that? DJ Turner. I never remember who number five is. I think it's Turner. A little crick in my neck today. Oh. I saw this article yesterday about uh, on Monday from M Live. M Live, bunch of fake news pur purveyors. Uh, Michigan begins workouts as coronavirus spreads everywhere and that's just journalistic in, un, in you know uh no journalistic integrity to me because it's not spreading in this room i'm in playing this game so to say it's everywhere fake news but i don't necessarily understand the, the fear porn of the media like why they want to continue to harp on the coronavirus no one no college kids are dying and the fact that every time someone tests positive which is going to continue to happen it turns into this big ordeal where people whose jobs are to cover sports are wishing that there were no sports. I'm not, I'm not sure why that's happening, but it continues to. So it doesn't, I, I kind of feel like these guys haven't worked for two or three months and they, they kind of like it. Damn it. Uh, but what they're going to miss out is that if there's no sports, then you know, they don't really have a job for too long. So we'll see how long they're able to keep that up. Especially guys in the national media like uh, Dan Woken, who's, who's Mr. Woke, and then uh, uh, what's his name, that Darren Ravel. It's like there are zero 18 to 23 year olds in the country that have died that are athletically fit, like a college football player. So this fear porn over coronavirus in the media has got to stop. Type W in the chat though if you washed your hands today because hey, gotta, gotta keep, gotta stay safe. Yeah, yeah, camera grown. Nice, whoop, spin move. Interception, that's what I'm talking about. Nice. Let's watch this replay. I think Michael Penix Jr. needs to, he's a way, think about who he's throwing to. Someone kept telling me, my guy uh, on IG kept saying that I got to throw to like, I don't know what he was saying, but he's telling me I'm not going for the, the jugular when I need to. And there's like something on the screen that tells me like a momentum changer or something like that. I'll look and tell you exactly what it is. I'm going up top of Nico though. What do you, who do you think I am? I think you're dealing with Lloyd Carr, his uncle, Coach Jimmy. Oh, the delay, it's the delay. All right, all right, let's see what we got here. Got distracted. I co coached in my ear. <laughs> ah, that was a bad play. Okay. I feel like this number 87 probably on steroids. That's why that happened. Got P 
people coming in and out of the studio. Come on. Distracting me. Third and 23. Let's see what we got. Giles Jackson. Little. Come on, throw it. Little Ball State Special. Woo! Yeah. The Ball State Special. Look at that. Steps into the pocket. Gets hit. Takes the hit. Hits Giles. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, man. This kid McCaffrey's got confidence right now. So what we're going to do, we are going to run the ball. Ooh, a little off tackle. Let's see what we got there. All right, five yards, I'll take it. I'll take it, we're a running team. There's not that many great running options out of shotgun out of this freaking offense that we run. Seconds on the clock, Yoder, come on. You got the shotgun normal or something stupid like that. Okay, 10 seconds. Go, 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 go. Nice, get that first. Whoa, whoa, watch our quarterback, Charbonnet. And come on. Oh, okay. cut back, cut back, cut back, cut back, cut back. Nice, 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 nice. Keep it running, keep it running, keep it running. Catch him off, catch him off guard. Cut back, whoop, whoop, whoop. Third and one. We're a running team. Get in there, touchdown. Strike up the victors. That's what I'm talking about. Hey, we got all three timeouts. You know, they don't do anything on offense. This, this offense is humming. I think that's the most points we scored in the first half probably all year. I don't know. Oh, man. Dun, hail to the victors, valiant hail to the country and heroes. Hail, hail to the oh, by the way, it's homecoming. So all the... Uh, all the old old school guys. Uh, have you ever been to a Michigan game that uh, you see, homecoming game? You see the uh, the 90 year old former male cheerleaders, female cheerleaders doing flips and doing push ups and all that stuff. That's what we got going on today. It's homecoming. So for all you NCAA 14 Michigan football alumni, um, welcome home. Welcome back to campus. Uh, myself as coach, I welcome you back. And I appreciate what we've done for this program. I stand on the shoulders of giants um, uh, that put this pro program in a position we're at. About to go 7 0, number three in the country. Oh, sh I, don't know. I thought I was in the back guy. A uh, little too focused on talking to you, less on the, you know, not enough of the game. Yeah, accept it like a coward.
Boom, hit him. Oh, shit. Damn it. Now, what happened there? What happened there? I'm not gonna bore you guys the replay either, but somebody fell down, okay? Let's just say that. Coaching was right. Boom! No way that guy gets that pass off. He's got absolutely baptized by who? Cam McGrown? No way that guy gets that pass off. We're not gonna let these guys score here. Not a touchdown. I'm gonna switch to a little zone. We're gonna be a little too aggressive to call us on it. Meh. Nothing, nothing, nothing on Ambry Thomas. I don't think Ambry's caught a ball on Ambry Thomas all year. That's what it is. Okay, they want to score touchdowns touchdown getting back in this game, so I'm going to go with a full zone, cover three. Let's see what we've got. Let's see what Quiddy's got. Yo, yeah, oh, pick that, Ambry! Stick with this uh, this cover three. <sighs> yeah. Oh, jeez. Hit him! Hit him! No, get damn it! Oh, I'm get the first. Come on! <sighs> oh, neck is killing me. Hey, go blitz now, baby. Let's go. Boom. No way this guy has that kind of composure. No way. Come on. This is bull. Bullshit. Okay, I said the word. No way this team gets this. No way that quarterback hits the pass that he has in this drive. How much time did they leave us? 19 seconds. Probably not enough, but whatever. More problems in Indiana. Okay, Michigan, I know. I know you did good against them last year, but it never ends. All right, a game nobody cares about. Brandon Peters, 13 and 46. All right. I think Wisconsin's gonna kind of stink this year. Don't you guys think they're gonna suck? I should probably not have pulled that out, but maybe I can get somebody off guard. No, I wasted three seconds. Okay, not that bad, I guess. I think without Jonathan Taylor, I don't necessarily think they're gonna be a sweet team this year by any means. Let's eat AJ Henning in the game. Number 89. Let's go four verts. Nico Collins put the team on his back, too. Oh, yeah, that was exactly what I was not wanting to do. <laughs> Oh man, that guy read me like a cheap newspaper. Oh gosh. I'll take McCaffrey's stats for the most part, but that was brutal. That was brutal. Brutal play call. Brutal play call. I'll put that in the coaches. Put that in the coaches. That wasn't Dylan's fault. Get him! Yes! Aiden Hutchinson, that's what I'm talking about. Coach Donnie, defensive coordinator Donnie, hit that. I just worked on. <coughs> nice work, DC Don.
pick that, pick that. Yeah, Dax Hill. Come on, run it back. You got this? Okay, you got it. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Oh, God. Nice. What's this play call? Where's this? What? Huh? Oh, wait, was that, that was after the play, okay. Whew. Okay, halftime, 17-10 Michigan. We'll take it. 17-3 even a lot nicer, but we'll take it. Get, oh, we're kicking off. Fuck. I forgot that we were getting the ball. Damn, okay. Well, let's see, look at these stats. 183 yards, five first downs, 17 points, okay. Defense gave up like two plays and some just unbelievable throws by their, their quarterback, um, which I didn't necessarily agree were real throws. Yes, this job, who was that? I think five, is it Selden? I don't know. Good. It is Selden, okay. Nice! Oh yeah, Dax, go back, second pick, second pick of the Go, take him back to the house, take him back to the house, take him back to the house. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh! Sorry, I just got too, I got too anxious with my spin moves. That's all right, that's a great play. That's a great play. Two interceptions. Nice. Let's see what I, I, I Good read cutting back here across the way because they had him and then I should have spun right here. I should not have spun back in, but whatever. Okay, now we're cooking. Now we are cooking. All right, two yards, that's okay. They were reading that one. You know, I'm trying to work on my outside running game. We've been okay inside, let's try our outside running game. I'm mixing in some of these sweeps. There you go, there you go, there you go, there you go. Nice, five yards. Probably had a bigger hole than Expected there, but didn't cut. field goal here, although that is a coward move. Coward Yoder. Jimmy. Oh no! How the fuck you missed 20 yard field goal, dude? Oh no! Oh! No! Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, fuck. Screen pass. Oh, it's gonna be on the screen pass. Run, hurry up.
Oh, no way I gotta get that. Come on. They're running some sort of wizardry offense here. Triple option, what is this, 1947 Army? Oh, gosh. Oh, this is just turning out to be a, a brutal sec, you know, turn of events. Ever since the, uh, not, not capitalizing on those turnovers, missing a field goal. Nice job, Aiden. Okay, they seem to want to run the ball here. So I guess I just got to read the room and not defend the pass all day. I really just cannot tackle a guy in the open field. <sighs> Come on, hit him. Nice. Way to break the tackle. This is what I'm talking about. Cam McGrone. He got... That was a good play call by them, but... Uh, I think that was, yeah, that's right. Safety. <sighs> Second and 12. Do not fall for the screen pass. Do not fall for the screen pass. Do not fall for the screen pass. Mm, they're going to block him if they hit him. Open field tackle. Ambry Thomas. I'm going to run a zone here. I hate running zone, but... Man coverage, they're just kicking our ass right now with all these misdirection bullshit plays. Screen, screen, screen. Now, what are they doing here? Oh, gosh, I had no idea what was going on there. I don't even know who 58 is, but I'm, I'm giving you some, I'm showing you love, brother. Stick a zone right here, too. Fourth and six, let's go. Chant with me at home, guys. Defense. Smith. Oh, Mozzie Smith getting some snaps. What the hell happened to hitting? Is he tired? Get him. Hit the, hit the, yes. Yes. That's what I'm talking about. Look at this play right here. Look at this. Look at this. This is just, we wanted it more right there. We wanted it more. Tip the cap to you, sir. Now we're going to show you what a, a Coach Jimmy offense looks like. We are men. We're a running team. We're just we're going to run the same play 13 times in a row, score a touchdown, end the game. That's what I'm talking about right here. Keep it moving. Keep it moving. All right, score alert across the bottom. Arkansas beating Alabama. Keep it running. Zach Charbonnet. All day Charbonnet. That number three next to Michigan looks a lot better than, uh, I don't know, whatever they were last year, like number 14 all year. Oh, they think we're passing. Ooh, big hole. We get one hat and a guy right up the middle. Oh, gosh, I got to hit a hole. All right, please, please stick that one. Flame that on the controller. Woo! They're down. Let's catch them off guard. Catch them off guard. They think we're running it. I think we're running. Oh, set up. Okay. Interesting. Of course, throw a triple coverage. Still catch it. Boom. In your face. I'm kind of a one read guy. 
you know, I have a guy I'm going for. Eight of 13, 214, a touchdown interception for Dylan McCaffrey. Efficient, he's, a, he's not as talented, I don't think, as Milton, but I'll take the, uh, the efficiency with his running game. We're a running team. Let's see if I can get a sharp 100 yards in this game. He's got 67 right now, and he's 33 more. That's why I'm such a good uh, coach. I can do quick math. You try any of these bums like Sam Webb, no math skills. Look at that, hit that hole. Yeah, close pretty quick for three yards. Pump fake your ass. Oh. Hey, the safety's coming down. Now it's getting now it's getting interesting because I gotta kick a field goal. I think if if we get stopped here, I do not want to throw an interception though. I do not want to throw an interception. A 13 yard line. And in this offense, the Air Jordan offense, we have not shown the ability to not throw interceptions. So I'm gonna have to run it here with this read option. Yeah, I make the wrong read again. Damn it. Bo Robbins, nice name. What kind of name is that? Long enough. It's good. 10 point win. 10 point game. That's what I'm talking about. Look, we're not blowing people out. I get it. You guys get it. Everybody wants to give me advice. That's okay. Whatever, okay? Whatever. Did that on purpose. All I know is this is the best Michigan football season ever because we won three games in the last 15 seconds, okay? Best game in history against Penn State on Saturday. That was awesome. Fucking awesome. Fucking awesome. And now all I want to do is injure this quarterback for Indiana. I'm, I'm okay with saying that. It's the kind of coach I am. We like to take out the other team's players in, in a legal manner. Boom. Oh, shit. Not worth the time. Hit him. Hit him, Dax. I want this defense to inflict pain. Work out your problems with pain to the other guy. That's what we teach him. Boom. Oh, God. Chris Hinton, I'm talking about tracking down, tracking, tracking down Stevie Scott. All right, it's clearly these guys aren't going to pass the ball, so I'm just going to go back to the zone, I guess. I don't know. Hit him fast. Oh, nice defense. Nice defense, Vincent Gray. Gray Island is what we call that. Gray Island. Drop the ball. Rashawn Williams, drop the ball. Third and one. Good stop here. They're going to run it. They go all out blitz. I'm going to do. They need guts. They just go deep here. No way the guy gets that. All right, nice. It's fourth and four. We're in a little zone here. Should I call timeout? Guys are, guys are feeling it. Call timeout. No. Defense. Let's go. Hit him. What is that? Oh no. Yeah. A comedy of errors, but we still get to stop. That's 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 what championship teams do. That's what great coaches do. Hit 
And now I want to go for the drug. And now, now I know I'm going against in the BCS ranking, the Bias BCS. That's what it stands for, the Bias Championship Series. They want, they want um, style points, so I got to give it to them. Mike Sainter still, get in there, touchdown. Give me the touchdown. Give me the touchdown. Oh, you gonna know, steal a man's touchdown? Let's see this. Re let's see this replay, though. Let's see this replay. No, oh, they gave it to me. Cue up the victors. Now we're just gonna practice things for the. Uh, that practice for the future is what, what we got to do here. So I don't think they can score 17 points. So what we're going to do is run a little read option for two points. <sighs> oh, right read finally, but didn't get it. That's okay. All right, two years in a row. Brandon Peters beating Wisconsin. Jack Cohn, 340 and three touchdowns. <clears throat> Surprised Cohn got the start last year. I mean, they had a, Wisconsin had a five-star freshman quarterback for the first time ever. His name Mertz or whatever. Um, be surprised that he doesn't, you know, that he doesn't start this year. When does Wisconsin get that kind of quarterback talent? They usually got, you know, six foot two white guys who don't do anything in the NFL can barely throw system quarterbacks. Mm. Read that. The defensive call read that, of course. Carlo. All right, for those of you guys who haven't watched one of our games before, make sure you subscribe to the channel, like this video. Let's see if we can put up, you know, 30 points today. But let's see if we can get some more likes on this video from you guys. Woo, what a play. Nice play by them. All right, give me a like, give me a like, give me a like. Nice, nice interception, Amber Thomas. Defense came to play, four picks. So the best defense in the country. See if we can hit him with a little quarterback fake. Go. Damn it. Okay. That didn't work very well. They were blitzing. Fifteen hundred on the sea, straight up. Let him, Giles. Okay, let's get three hundred. Let's get three hundred for McCaff. Let's get three hundred. I don't even want to know what that monster is. That looks so scary to even try and run. I don't even want to know what that is. Ooh, quads trio looks looks intimidating. Oh gosh, that's gonna be an interception. Damn it. Oh, 
Ow. <sighs> Those are the style of horns we were looking for, that's for sure. Probably makes it not the best defense in America anymore against points. Now they're going to go for two. Oh, crap. Oh, gosh. They're going to go for two. They're going to cut it. That's what I did not think of when I went for two, is it? Oh, boy. Yeah, they can cut it to one possession game if they get this. Let's hope that they don't. Boom. Stop him. Nice. 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 Probably gonna kick on side, right? Yeah. I don't even want any of my guys near here. Just go to somebody else. Nice. Right belt. Dive. Dive. Whoa. I know you guys are telling me to run the ball, all this stuff. Hell no. We're trying to score a touchdown. Style points. They're gonna score. We're gonna score. I do realize that. Um, comeback routes, ten yard comeback, don't work in deep zones. So now I know that. Now I know. My five yards, there you go, 300 yards. That's what we're looking for. Get the man to 300. Starting to figure out what this setup play is that, that I keep hearing about. <laughs> How many yards for Charbonnet? How many yards? Give me 100. Okay, we need 19 more. We're gonna get him that 100. We got 300 for what's his, for McCaffrey, and he get 100 for, the 100 for Charbonnet. Whoop. Did they call a timeout? I don't know. Maybe we won't get a hundred, I don't know. We gotta pass here now. Oh gosh. Time out, time out, time out. No, yeah, it takes him below below three hundred, doesn't it? Damn it. Let's go blue. Oof. Oh, I guess it uh, took away from rushing yards. That's right. Is that pros that they take away? From? Oh, I don't know. Oh, Nice. Oh, he dropped it. Come on, dude. Gosh, damn. That's literally the second time he Giles has dropped one. Touchdown in like the final play of the game for us. Unbelievable. He's, he's hot and he's cold. Team on green in the game? Okay.
All right, the spread was 14. We didn't cover the spread. All good. There it is. Here, look quickly at the stats. We'll be back on Friday, uh, 3.30 Eastern, Friday. In the live chat, you can watch the game anytime you want, though. So Friday uh, is the game. Dax Hill, three tackles, two picks is our player of the game. A lot of good performance in the defense. Gave up only 10 points, seven of them coming on that pick six. So, um, or six of them, I guess they didn't get their... Uh, Take a quick look at the stats, and we are out. Playa stats. Caffrey 11, 20, 300, 2 and 2. Four Sack four times, got to solve that. Uh, Charbonnet 18, 80, one touchdown. Caffrey, you know, six, four to sack, 51 yards negative on the rushing front. Eubanks is our player. So only one catch for Nico today. Uh, so Eubanks 354, Sainer still 3 of 69, Giles 3 of 92, and that damn drop at the end. He could have had two touchdowns. Sainer still and Jackson get the touchdown, speed and space. Nico won, Ronnie Bell won. All together, I like the over the middle, the, the kind of slot and tight end we had today. Let's take a look at the defense. Six tackles for DJ Turner. So he's number five. Okay, I'm, I'm like that. Who is number five? So Seldon's what number in this game? Seldon's 22. Um, a lot of tackles, though. Indiana ran a lot of plays. Interceptions, one for Ambry, two for Dax Hill, and one for Cam McGrone in there somewhere. You see one tackle for him, one interception. So that is the game. 26-16, Michigan wins. And that's all. We will see you guys back on Friday, 3.30 Eastern. we got Michigan State. Go Blue.